treatment of goodwill problems very very important many times one mark bits two mark bits if you don't have two mark bits that means you may have two one mark bits which may come on this treatment of goodwill admission of a partner treatment of goodwill admission of a partner right on a problem ram and rahim were partners ram and rahim were partners sharing profits and losses in the sharing profits and losses equally sharing profits and losses equally they agreed to admit karim as a partner they agreed to admit karim as a partner they agreed to admit karim as a partner new profit sharing ratio 4 is to 3 is to 3 new profit sharing ratio 4 is to 3 is to 3 full stop goodwill of the firm goodwill of the firm goodwill of the firm was valued at 2 lakh rupees the goodwill of the firm was valued at 2 lakh rupees full stop show the treatment of goodwill show the treatment of goodwill in the books of the firm in the books of the firm under following circumstances show the treatment of goodwill in the books of the firm under following circumstances this is the basic problem what is the problem the old partners were ram and rahim they were sharing profits and loss in the ratio of equally 1 is to 1 or for the sake of ease you may also take it as 5 is to 5 or 1 is to 1 no problem next what did they agree on they agreed to take mr karim as a partner and new profit sharing ratio decided among them was 4 is to 3 is to 3 so you are given old ratio you are also given the new profit sharing ratio so information is available to calculate the sacrificing ratio what is the value of the goodwill of the firm decided the value of the goodwill of the firm was decided 2 lakh rupees was the value of the goodwill of the firm now the problem is asking you to show the treatment of goodwill under various circumstances right now case number 1 case number 1 this is the basic problem now we are going to add different different types of masala to the same basic problem and try to solve the problem is it clear Right on. Case number one. Karim is unable to bring cash for his share of goodwill. Karim is unable to bring cash for a, for his share of goodwill. Karim is unable to bring cash for his share of goodwill. And and it was decided to show. goodwill in the balance sheet after admission it was decided to show goodwill in the balance sheet after admission it was decided to show the goodwill in the balance sheet after admission this is the circumstance now this is the masala how will you pass the entry 
So what method are you going to apply? Karik is a new partner. Is, is, he, is he able to bring cash for a share of goodwill or unable to bring cash? He is unable to bring cash for a share of goodwill. And what is the problem saying? We are ready to show goodwill in the balance sheet after admission of the partner. So which method are we going to follow? We are going to follow revaluation method, not memorandum revaluation method. Goodwill account can appear in the balance sheet after admission of a partner. So we need not close goodwill account. So in this circumstance, we have to follow the first method, revaluation method, right on. In the above circumstance, answer. In the above circumstance, revaluation method should be applied. Watermelon should be brought into the balance sheet. That's it. But it should not be eaten by anybody. We are going to show watermelon also in the balance sheet. Write down. What is entry you are going to write? Goodwill account data. Goodwill account data. You write the heading when goodwill is raised. When goodwill is raised. When watermelon is brought into the books. What is this watermelon? Juicy profits of the future, which we are now showing in the books of accounts. Goodwill account retar. Goodwill account retar. 2 lakh rupees. Goodwill of the firm. Now tell me, because of whose hard work this profit is going to come in the future? Ramen Rahim. Only Ramen Rahim. Hence, this has to be credited to Ramen Rahim only. Right on. To Ram Capital Account to Rahim Capital Account. In which ratio will you share it? Equally. Equally. Old profit sharing ratio. 1 lakh and 1 lakh. That's it. If you pass this entry, what will happen? No? An asset will come into the books of accounts. Goodwill account will be debited. It will show a debit balance. It will be shown in the balance sheet. Because of this entry, Ram capital account balance will be increased. Raheem capital account balance will also be increased. Okay. That's it. We are going to pass only one entry and stop. Right now. Case 2 now. Case 2. Case 2. What is the second case now? Right on. Kareem is unable to bring cash. Kareem is unable to bring cash for his share of goodwill. And it was decided. And it was decided. It was decided to show, it was decided not to show goodwill in the balance sheet. And it was decided not to show goodwill in the balance sheet after admission. It was decided not to show goodwill in the balance sheet after admission. Okay. So we are not going to show goodwill in the balance sheet after admission of the partner. So what are we going to do now? He is not bringing cash and we have decided not to show goodwill in the balance sheet. So how do we do effect? Second method, memorandum revaluation method. We have to raise goodwill in old profit sharing ratio and we have to write off goodwill in new profit sharing ratio. Write off. When goodwill is raised, when goodwill is raised, A. When goodwill is raised, what is entry we are going to pass? Goodwill account data. Goodwill account data 2 lakh to Ram capital account to Raheem capital account. How much? 1 lakh and 1 lakh. Now, if you pass this entry, no? 
goodwill account will come into the books. Ram capital account and rising capital account balance will be increased. But what did they decide? They decided not to show goodwill in the balance sheet. Because of this entry, goodwill account will appear. But they don't want to show it now. So what we have to do? Close the account. But when we are closing the account, when we are sharing the watermelon, we have to share it in the new profit sharing ratio. Brought in old ratio, but shared in new profit sharing ratio. Right on. When goodwill is written off. When goodwill is written off. What is the entry you are going to write when goodwill is written off? All partners capital account debt are to goodwill account. Which ratio? New profit sharing ratio. Ram capital account, Raheem capital account, Kareem capital account. Come in. Two goodwill account. Same goodwill you have to now write off. Two lakh. In which ratio you have to write off? New profit sharing ratio. Four is to three is to three. Four is to three is to three ratio you have to write off. Eighty thousand, sixty thousand, sixty thousand. So we raise the goodwill in old profit sharing ratio and then we write off the goodwill in new profit sharing ratio. Is it clear? Write down. Situation C. Case 3. Case 3. Write down. Kareem is unable to bring cash. Kareem is unable to bring cash. for his share of goodwill. Kareem is unable to bring cash for his share of goodwill. And it was decided to give treatment to goodwill. It was decided to give treatment to goodwill. Without, without involving goodwill account. Or, or, treatment had to be given through the capital accounts of the partners. Treatment had to be given through the capital account of the partners. So it was decided to give the treatment through the capital account of the partners without involving goodwill account. You have to give treatment to goodwill, but you cannot open goodwill account. Involving means you cannot open, you cannot close. You have to give treatment of goodwill, but without opening, without closing goodwill account. Without touching goodwill account, you have to give treatment of goodwill. Directly through the capital accounts of the partners. Which method are we talking about? This is the... What method did you say? Exactly wrong. That is not the method we are going to follow. When do you follow premium method then? When goodwill is brought in cash. But in this account we are not saying the problem we, we said Karim is unable to bring cash. Now listen to me. It is the same memorandum revaluation method same method, but we are not going to pass two entries. We are going to take the net effect, net effect of these two entries and we are going to pass the entry. Is it clear? We will see how that entry comes. Before that, I will give you the formula. Write down. How you write the entry in such a situation? When a question is asked like this, how to deal with it? Write down. You write. Gaining partners capital account data. Gaining partners capital account data. 
How much amount should be debited? Look at the board. Goodwill of firm into gaining ratio of the partner. Into gaining ratio of the partner. Okay. Then to sacrificing partners capital account credit in sacrificing ratio. So when a question is asked like this, this is the formula you have to use. What is the entry you are going to pass? Gaining partners capital account data. How much amount you have to debit? Goodwill of the firm into gaining ratio. You have to give credit to whom? Sacrificing partners capital account credit. In which ratio? Sacrificing ratio. Okay. Now in this problem, can you identify who is the gaining partner? Pakka. Kareem is the gaining partner because he was not there till now. Suddenly he has come. So he is definitely a gaining partner in the firm. So write down. Kareem capital account data. Now please tell me, 2 lakh is the expected super profits. In that 2 lakh, how much will Kareem enjoy in the future? How much is share? 3 by 10. He is going to enjoy 3 by 10 of the 2 lakhs. Now what is 2 lakh boss? It is expected super profit in the future. Out of the 2 lakh, Kareem will enjoy 2 by, not 2 by 10, 3 by 10 he is going to enjoy. So he has to now suffer and compensate the other partners because this 30,000 which Kareem is going to get in super profits in the future, Actually, it belongs to whom? Ram and Rahim. Ram and Rahim are sacrificing in favor of Kareem. That is why he can enjoy in the future. Because he can enjoy in the future, today he has to compensate Ram and Rahim. So Ram and Rahim are selling a share to Kareem. They are not donating. You will understand, they are not donating a share. They are saying, boss, in the future, out of 2 lakhs, you are going to get some share. 3 by 10. It's not 30,000, it is 60,000. 2 lakh into 3 by 10, you are going to get 60,000. Why should we sacrifice in your favor? It is our profit you are going to take in the future. Give us money now, enjoy it in future. If he agrees, he will be admitted as a partner. If he doesn't agree, we will say Tata away to him. We will try to find somebody who is ready to give us goodwill. In future, we get this 2 lakh profits. Karim will get 3 by 10 share. 60,000 will get share in profit in the future. Why will we give them for free boss? We will say you are going to enjoy 60,000 in the future. Give us 60,000 now, enjoy it in future. But if, if he wants, he will enter. So he has to pay money to the existing partners and then enter. Is it clear? So Karihan is going to gain how much? 2 lakh into 3 by 10, his share, 60,000. So Karihan capital account debited with how much? 60,000. Now this 60,000, who is losing? Ram and Rahim. To Ram capital account, to Rahim capital account, Out of 60,000, how much Ram has sacrificed, how much Rahim has sacrificed? We have to calculate, no equally. Old ratio and new ratio are given. You have to calculate the sacrificing ratio. Right on. Calculation of sacrificing ratio. Ram. Old ratio minus new ratio. 1 by 2 minus 4 by 10. 1 by 2. Multiply in the denominator. Multiply in the numerator by 5. Minus 4 by 10. 5 by 10 minus 4 by 10. It is 1 by 10. Rahim. Old ratio minus new ratio. 1 by 2 minus 3 by 10. 1 by 2 into 5 by 5 minus 3 by 10. It is 5 by 10 minus 3 by 10. 2 by 10. Both are sacrificing partners. Both are sacrificing partners. Ram and Rahim. But how much Ram has sacrificed? 1 by 10. How much Rahim has sacrificed? 2 by 10. So let us see whether we are getting the same answer or not. 2 by 2 lakh into 1 by 10. 20,000. 2 lakh 
into 2 by 10 40,000 is it tally or 1 is to 2 ratio 1 by 10 and 2 by 10 are in which ratio 1 is to 2 says give treatment of goodwill through capital account and the problem says what give treatment of goodwill through capital account or problem says give treatment of goodwill without involving goodwill account then this is the method you are going to follow sacrificing partners capital account has to be credited gaining partners capital account has to be debited now see whether it is same as these two entries or not look at the board this was memorandum revaluation method entries, no? Case 2. Both are same actually. Let's see. Goodwill debit, goodwill credit cancel. 80 debit, 1 lakh credit. So what is the net effect remaining? 20,000 credit. 60,000 debit, 1 lakh credit. 40,000 credit. What is the entry that remains? What is the entire remains? Kari capital account data 60,000 to Ram capital account 20,000 to Rahim capital account credit 40,000. Same entry you got? So actually it is the same memorandum revaluation method but it is the net effect of the two entries we pass. Is it clear? Did you get the same entry or not? So when will you apply this method? And the problem says new part is unable to bring cash per share of goodwill and second it says Goodwill treatment has to be given without involving goodwill account. Or the problem says you have to give treatment of goodwill through the capital accounts of the partners. Then this is the entry we are going to pass. What is the entry we are going to pass? Gaining partners, capital account, debit. How much debit? Goodwill of the firm into his gaining ratio to sacrificing partners, capital account, credit. In which ratio this amount should be shared in? Sacrificing ratio. Is it clear? This is case 3, case 4. Case 4, write down. Kareem brings his share of goodwill in cash Kareem brings his share of goodwill in cash Karim is now bringing his share of goodwill in cash. Now what will you do? Which method will you apply? His share of goodwill in cash. Which method will you apply? Premium method. What is the entry into premium method? Cash account data. How much cash will come? Karim will bring his share of goodwill in cash. What is his share of goodwill in cash? 3 by 10. 2 lakh into 3 by 10. 60,000 Karim is going to bring in cash. But this amount has to be given to whom and whom now? Ram and Rahim. Okay, right on. Cash account data 2 lakh into 30 percent. Cash account data 2 lakh into 30 percent. 3 by 10. 30 percent is 3 by 10. Understand? Cash account data 2 lakh into 3 by 10. How much? 60,000. But who should be credited? Not Kareem. Ram and Rahim. Right on to Ram capital account, to Rahim capital account, in which ratio? Sacrificing ratio. To Ram capital account, to Rahim capital account, sacrificing ratio. 60,000 should be credited to Ram and Rahim, in the ratio of 20,000 in the amount 20,000 and 40,000. So what is the entry we are going to pass under case 4? Cash account retard 60,000. Who brought this cash? Kareem. But to whom are we giving credit? Ram and Rahim. 
What does that mean? This means Ram can withdraw 20,000, Rahim can withdraw 20, 40,000 and enjoy. Because they have put in hard work, no boss. In future, you are going to enjoy my profit. So you are giving me cash now. So this cash I can enjoy. Who can enjoy? Ram and Rahim can enjoy. Who has to suffer? Kareem. Because he is going to enjoy in the future. Next. Ace five. Ace five. And down. Kareem. Kareem. Pays cash privately to Ram and Rahim. Kareem pays cash privately to Ram and Rahim. For goodwill. For goodwill. What is the accounting treatment? No entry. Ah, right down. No entry in the books of accounts. No entry in the books of accounts. Right down. Next. Over here. Next case number six. six right now, Kareem brings Kareem brings cash for his share of goodwill. Kareem brings cash for his share of goodwill. Full stop. Ram and Rahim withdraw. Ram and Rahim with the draw half of the amount credited to them. Ram and Rahim with the draw half of the amount credited to them. So again, we are talking about premium method only. Karim brings how much? His share of goodwill in cash. Add on the entry, what is it will write? Cash account data 60,000. Cash account data 60,000. To Ram account, to Rahim account. Cash account data 60,000. To Ram account, to Rahim account. Cash account data 60,000 to Ram account to Rahim account. This is the normal entry when cash is brought by Kari. Now, some additional problem information is given to you in the problem. No, you write 20 and 40 first. Copy that one entry that. Copy down that entry first. Cash account data 60,000 to Ram account to Rahim account. 20,000 and 40,000. Is it clear? Now, how much is credited to Ram and Rahim? 20 and 40. They can withdraw this much and enjoy. But what they have decided? They have decided to withdraw half of the amount credited to them. Right now, when partners withdraw cash. When partners withdraw cash. Right? Ram capital account at our 10,000. Rahim capital account at our 20,000. Two cash account. Two cash account 30,000. Okay. Not over yet. One more case. Case number 7. Case number seven. Case number seven. Right on. Kareem is able to bring. Kareem is able to bring only half of the amount. Towards goodwill. Half of 
the amount towards goodwill and for the remaining half treatment has to be given through capital accounts of the partners for the remaining half treatment has to be given through capital account of the partners look at the board everyone Kareem share in goodwill. Kareem share in goodwill, sixty thousand. Okay, he has to bring sixty thousand. But what is he doing? Brings in cash thirty thousand. Unable to bring cash thirty thousand. How do you deal with it now? For this we can follow premium method. For this we can follow memorandum revaluation method. And the problem is saying what? For the remaining half you have to give treatment through the capital account of the partners. Okay. So below this I will pass the entry. Cash account debtor 30,000. It has to be credited to whom? Sacrificing partners. Ram Rahim. Ram and Rahim. In which ratio? Sacrificing ratio. What was the ratio? 1 is to 2. Okay. For this half, Kareem's capital account has to be reduced by 30,000. Ram's and Rahim's capital account has to be increased by 30,000. Or, Kareem will appear as a debtor to the business for 30,000. Ram and Rahim will become creditors to the business for 30,000. See, he has to bring, no? He is not bringing. Is he not a debtor to the firm? He has to give. He is not giving. If I show him as a debtor, do you object? No. So I will show him as a debtor. Kareem, capital account debtor. How much is unable to bring? 30,000. This will be enjoyed by whom? Ram and Rahim. Ram capital account, credit 10,000. Rahim capital account, credit 20,000. Note down this. So this is how we are going to deal. Sometimes there can be a mixture. This is a problem, this is a situation where we are mixing two methods. Premium and memorandum revaluation method.
feel all situations are over? No. Some more masala can be added. Write down. Write down. Case number 8. Write down. Case number 8. Kareem is unable to bring cash for his share of goodwill. Kareem is unable to bring cash for his share of goodwill. Full stop. Continue. New profit sharing ratio new profit sharing ratio decided at the time of admission was new profit sharing ratio decided at the time of admission was six is two six is two 1 is 2, 3. Okay. Suppose the new profit sharing ratio was not, I think I have already discussed what profit sharing ratio. What was the new profit sharing ratio given in the main problem? 4 is 2, 3 is 2, 3. Suppose new profit sharing ratio was not 4 is 2, 3 is 2, 3. It was what? 6 is 2, 1 is 2, 3. And Karim is unable to bring cash for his share of goodwill. Full stop. Continue. It was decided to give treatment of goodwill through capital accounts of the partners. It was decided to give treatment of goodwill through the capital accounts of the partners. Look at the board everyone. What was old ratio? 1 is to 1. New profit sharing ratio? 6 is to 1 is to 3. Okay. And is Kareem able to bring cash for a share of goodwill? No. And we have decided to give treatment of goodwill through the capital accounts. So which method are we going to follow? Memorandum, revaluation method. But without involving goodwill accounts. I think you remember we have already discussed this Case number 3, you please go back. I have given you the formula how to deal with the situation. And the prob when the problem says don't open goodwill account, don't touch goodwill account, give treatment to capital accounts. What is the entry taught you? Gaining partner's capital account credit. Sorry, gaining partner's capital account debit. How much? Their gaining goodwill. Two sacrificing partner's capital account credit. Their sacrificing goodwill. That is what you have to do, no? So, before we start doing the problem, tell me who has gained and who has lost. Right on. Sacrificing ratios will calculate. Ram. Ram. What was the old ratio? 1 by 2. New ratio? 6 by 10. I showed you how to solve it. 1 by 2 into 5 into 5 minus 6 by 10 5 by 10 minus 6 by 10 minus 1 by 10 So Ram has not sacrificed He has gained This is gaining ratio See before before admission of curry out of 10 rupees he was getting only 5 now out of 10 he is going to get 6. Take a rupiah jada. Raheem. 1 by 2 minus he is pap bichara. 1 by 2 minus 1 by 10. 1 by 2 into 5 into 5 minus 1 by 10. 5 by 10 minus 1 by 10. 4 by 10. Loot liye. Oh, sorry.
sacrificing ratio. He has lost. Earlier he was getting 5 rupees out of 10. Now out of 10 rupees he is getting only 1. So his 4 rupees have been stolen away by somebody else now. Okay. Is it clear? Karim is over a gaining partner. Because earlier his share was 0. Now he is getting 3 by 10. So it is completely gaining ratio. Right on the entry now. Kareem capital account debtor 2 lakh into 3 by 10 60,000 Ram capital account debtor 2 lakh into 1 by 10 20,000 2 Raheem capital account credit 2 lakh into 4 by 10, 80,000. Gaining partners have been debited with their gain in goodwill. Sacrificing partners capital account has been credited with their sacrifice in goodwill. unable to bring cash for his share of goodwill. Kareem is unable to bring cash for his share of goodwill. Kareem is unable to bring cash for his share of goodwill. Karim is unable to bring cash for his share of goodwill. New profit sharing ratio. New profit sharing ratio. 4 is to 3 is to 3. Same old problem. We have gone back to our old problem. New profit sharing ratio. 4 is to 3 is to 3. Full stop. It was decided to give treatment of goodwill. It was decided to give treatment of goodwill to the capital accounts of the partners. To the capital accounts of the partners. to the capital accounts of the partners. Full stop. Last sentence. In the balance sheet before admission, goodwill appears at 50,000 rupees. balance sheet before admission goodwill appears at 50,000 rupees. Full stop. What is this? Some new masala, unknown masala. See, when Kari wanted to enter the firm, he said goodwill value is 2 lakh. That is latest valuation. But even before Kari was admitted, in the old balance sheet you can see some goodwill. There is an old small watermelon in the balance sheet already. The size of the watermelon now is big, 2 lakh. But there is some old watermelon also in the balance sheet. How much? 50,000. 
Now, if you show that watermelon to curry, what will he say? Ah, give me a piece immediately, I'll eat it and I'll give you money for that. Why? It will be very cheap for him. So, should we show that book, that old watermelon to him? No. Tell me. There's a small old watermelon in the balance sheet there already. So, when you are negotiating with curry, can you show that, that small watermelon and say, sir, this is the watermelon we have. So, take a piece, eat it, give me cash. He'll be more than happy. Why? The smaller the watermelon, the burden for him will be that much less. So what we should do before Kareem comes to the farm, we have to eat this watermelon ourselves. Then bring a very big watermelon and make that watermelon visible to Mr. Kareem. This old watermelon should not be shown to Kareem at all. Before he enters into the room, we have to close that old watermelon account. Is it clear? If he sees that, then he will say, Earlier you showed watermelon 50,000. Now we are saying watermelon 2 lakhs. He'll say you are trying to cheat me. So before he comes to the farm, what we should do? If there is any old watermelon in the books, cut it into pieces and eat it. Who should eat it? Only Raman Rahim, not Karim. Okay. He should never be even shown a smell of the old watermelon. Right on. Right on. The old goodwill account should be written off. First you should write a goodwill. The old goodwill account should be written off. The old goodwill account should be written off. The old goodwill account should be written off. In old profit sharing ratio. Among old partners. Old doesn't mean old by age. Existing partners. What is it? We'll write. We'll write Ram capital account debtor, Rahim capital account debtor, two goodwill accounts. Ram capital account debtor, Rahim capital account debtor, two goodwill accounts. Equally, 25,000, 25,000. With this story of old watermelon is over. Now the story with new watermelon will begin. Okay. And what we have decided, is Karim able to bring cash for the new watermelon? No. And it has decided to give treatment through what? Capital account of the partners. Right down. Treatment of new watermelon. Treatment of new watermelon with the brackets goodwill. You can never forget this watermelon. Or you have already forgotten. You are not answering. Remember. When the new watermelon or goodwill is treated through capital accounts of the partners. Treatment of new goodwill or treatment of new watermelon through the capital account of the partners. That is heading you right. Answer is same as case 3. Answer is same as case 3. Right on entry. Kareem capital account debtor 60,000. Kareem capital account debtor 60,000. To Ram capital account credit 20,000. To Raheem Capital Account Credit, 40,000. So when there is an existing goodwill in the balance sheet, what should you do? Kill that goodwill first and then give life to new goodwill. Old watermelon, eat it first before you bring the new watermelon to the negotiation table. Okay. So with this we complete treatment of goodwill when a new partner is admitted into the firm. Full stop.
tomorrow when we continue, I want you to bring the ICEI textbook.